Alrighty y'all, what's going on today? So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the Ralph Marlin strap. This is the Optic Impressions version. Um, Ralph Marlin makes tons of different straps and you know they all come in different... They're, they're all basically about the same sort of outlay in terms of like build, but as for the designs or the actual, I guess you could call them graphics that they have on the straps, they are all a uh, bit different. This one obviously is flames. I got this as a gift a while ago. To be honest, never really use it. I'm not really a flames guitar strap kind of guy. Although, you know, it's it's a well-made guitar strap, and if I'm looking at it objectively, I have to I have to say that you know it's 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 pretty good, and it's it would be a great guitar strap for really anyone from beginner to you know, veteran player. Anyway, Ralph Marlin, the uh, Optic Impression strap, straps, they come in an array of different designs. They have the Flames one, obviously. I think they have like a pouring beer one and some other just random funny ones. I see this as more like comedic kind of straps, more like niche kind of straps. And for what they are, they actually look pretty good. I mean, the Flames, as you can tell, are, are really, really nicely detailed. They're, you know, super cool, almost kind of have that, like, 50s rockabilly sort of sort of vibe to them. A few, like, know, like, the old, like, choppers, t-shirts. They kind of have that, that sort of vibe. But the graphics actually look really good. If you dig flames, you'll like this. I guess it's, it's high quality is what I'm saying. So you, so you basically have that. Strap is pretty thick. It is three inches wide, so it's, it's a little too thick for my taste, honestly. If you're a bigger guy or girl... This actually might be perfect for you because it's a little bit wider. Or if you have a heavy, heavier guitar, it might just feel a little better. It kind of gives you more room. So it's not just weighing down in a small strap on one part of your body. Maybe it's a little more comfortable because of that extra width. I don't know. I'm not really a huge fan of it. But it is one of the wider ones. So if you do like that, it adjusts from 47 inches to 61 inches. So, you know, pretty standard. Although it does go pretty long. The ends of the actual strap, these are made of leather. I'm pretty certain this is like a fake leather. It may, may not be, honestly, but it, it feels like it may be. You know, just because it's not, it's not super heavy, I think it's like a faux, faux kind of leather. Yeah, the ends are made of that. You have this gold seal. This looks like it was maybe some sort of like paint marker or something like that. It's a shiny gold. That's the Ralph Marlin logo. You also have this other little Ralph Marlin logo that acts as a little tag right there. It's made in the U.S., so you know you're, you know, getting something that's a high quality product. As for the actual material that's on the flames, this is like all stitched, as you can see along the entirety of the strap, and it's made of sort of like a, I don't know, it feels kind of like a nylon material. If you can tell, it waves around on top, so it's not, you know, it's not exactly painted onto the body of the strap but it's just a piece of fabric like nylon style fabric that is instead sewn on I kind of wish maybe it were on the actual strap just because you know this makes it more susceptible to tearing but you know you get what you get the other side of the strap you do have like uh, the leather material this is just a flat black leather I, like I said, I've maybe worn this once or twice when I was kind of out of luck, didn't have a strap. And uh, the leather is actually pretty comfortable. Even the edges right here, though they're squared off, it doesn't like cut into your skin or into your shirt or anything. So that's nice. And then, you know, up top you have your typical kind of nylon seatbelt style strap. Or this portion of the strap, I guess you could say. Very, very simple, easy to adjust with this little mechanism right here. As for actually holding it on your guitar, you have the two holes that are at each end. So this is not a clip strap. This is basically just hangs on the pegs at each end of your guitar. So yeah, overall, just, you know, very, very simple design. But unique in the way that, you know, it, it is it's very wide and has the, the interesting graphics on it. So yeah, if you're a big... You know, proponent of flame style things, and then you play guitar, I would highly recommend this. It's a cool, cool little strap, I guess. This is the Ralph Marlin Optic Impressions Flame Guitar Strap. Alrighty, guys, take it easy.